It is really easy to compute a weighted mean using either Excel or Google Sheets. The process is exactly the same. So I've got my data set here in a frequency list, and I want to go ahead and calculate the mean. As I'm calculating that mean, I could add these numbers up individually, right? I could take my 340s, and then I could start adding in those 441s, which I am not going to do because this would take forever, and then divide it by the total number n, which is 20. Instead, I'm going to use those frequencies, and I'm going to go ahead and multiply. So I'm going to take 40, there are three of those, plus 41, there are four of those, plus dot, 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 divide by n. This gives me my weighted mean formula. And that's going to use those products inside of the sum, that sigma is the summation. So each of my data values, x, that's the 40, 41, and so on, times my frequency, which is how many I've got of each one, divided by n. We can also think of that n as the sum of our frequencies. OK, now comes in, because this is going to make really easy work of this, either Excel or Google Sheets. Your process, your functions are identical in both of these. To calculate the weighted mean, I want to go ahead and call a function. So I'm going to use the equal sign. And I want to use that sum product function to get to that numerator. So sum product parenthesis. I'm going to go ahead and take my data values first. So I'm going to click, drag, and click, hold, and drag through the data, and then comma. Um, it's guessing my frequency, and it's guessing it correctly. You can go ahead and choose those. Or you can, again, click, hold, and drag for that second group. Parenthesis, I need to divide by n. You could just type in 20. I want to show you, just so you've got it in general here, how to go ahead and put in n as the sum of those frequencies. So I grabbed sum parenthesis, and then I click held and dragged through all of my frequencies, and then I'll hit enter. And it's that easy. There is your weighted mean of 42.35. Go ahead and check out the other video that I've got here on grouped frequency distributions. Thank you so much for watching.